Today, we are talking about the munch mitt. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Nicole, and on this channel, we talk about everything from parenting tips and tricks to product reviews and more. So if you're new here, definitely consider subscribing. So as I've been on my journey, being pregnant with my third baby, I've been looking at all kinds of cool new products for babies because so much changes in just two years. Um, that's how old my youngest is. So um, I came across this and it is called the Munch Mitt and it is a baby teething mitt. And what's really cool about this is I remember Jake used to chew on his hands all the time when he was teething, which I think honestly eventually led to him sucking his thumb. So if I can try to get ahead of that any way I can, and if you know how to get your child to stop sucking their thumb, please send all those tips to me. I welcome them. <laughs> anyway, I digress. So the munch mitt is this little thing. This is made out of BPA-free, phthalate-free silicone. So it has this great texture on the tip. It has an adjustable little Velcro band here, and it makes this crunchy sound, which we all know babies love that sound. And this is what that looks like. The mitt itself is water resistant, waterproof, um, and can be used on either hand. So I love that it's interchangeable because it looks the same on both sides. Um, it can be switched from hand to hand. I think it's such a cool new little um, invention since the last time I had my kiddos that I had to share it with you guys. Um, have any of you used the Munch Mitt before? Do you have any thoughts on it? Let me know in the comment box down below. Another thing I want to mention is it's recommended age on the packaging here. It says it's for three to seven months, but up to 12 months. So use your best judgment when using this for your child. Um, they do come in a variety of different colors, um, and I will leave links down below as to where you can find and purchase the product or just get more information if you're interested. And uh, yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comment box down below. I'd love to hear them. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see all of you guys again in my next video.